Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another part of Lumion Legacy: Veil vale of Darkness. Oh wait, wait, is it's it's Weight of Shadow, right? Weight of Darkness, Weight of Shadow. Oh god, I I guess I will never be able to pronounce it properly. Fuck, I'm Pepega. Anyways, you might re uh, you might um how's it called? You might remember that location. And I'm here again. I'm here again. But my team changed a little bit. So you can see my bed is level 23. We got a Cradle, which is now level 16. We as well got a gun pot. What is this sound? It's the sound of the of the oh god of the lumen. Yikes. Uh, we now also got a gun pot, which is water. We got it in the grass on route 8, I guess. Our twiddle evolved to paratreat. And we also got a Gaglo, but we got that from before. What we got is an Ignail. And I had to Google that because the catch rate was horrible and I thought like, what the fuck is that? Is that like a Lachy or something? It's, it's, it has Ancient type. I don't know what type that is, but it seems to be pretty rare. And I'm pretty glad that I got it. I just don't know what to do with it. Okay, good. Um, alrighty. Ooh, Skilava. We also got a Skilava, but it's not in our team. I was basically catching around. Uh, let's try if we can get to the next trainer without dying. That would be really appreciated. Of course I'd avoid it. What did I expect? I guess I'm just gonna use Bamboozle. I'm 23. It would be great if I could just one hit it. Of course it uses Torch, but Bamboozle... Still hits. Okay. I guess that's the special effect of Bamboozle. I guess Bamboozle is my best hit right now. It's maybe not the strongest, but it's definitely good enough to beat everything. I've also noticed that I kinda sound demotivated in the first parts. Um, which is kinda sad because I wasn't. Like, I'm, I'm super hyped to play this game, honestly. It's kinda sad that I, talked, that I sound demotivated. Also when I'm complaining about some uh, things happening. I mean, I'm always saying if you don't, if you don't complain, you're not, you don't have fun. Like, if you don't care about anything that is happening, then you probably have less fun than if you're, like, engaged. Or enraged because of things. Like, why would you care if you don't, if you don't care? <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, nice. Maybe I was also just sick or tired or whatever. But I can tell you I actually have fun playing this game. And I'm always sitting here when I'm grinding. Um, after the grind I'm here and like, ah, I would like to keep playing actually, but I won't. I will wait for the day to record. Which is right now. I'm kinda glad. I'm, I'm usually recording from f f uh, from Monday to Friday. And on, and then, and on, um, uh, and on the weekend and also on Friday I'm usually streaming. So, I rather do that then. So. Now it's dead, we might need to heal up. Which could take a long time, so I hope... I I might use a pod, actually. I want to do some progress, I don't have much time. I just I just recorded a Minecraft video. Um, of the Pi Pack 3. To basically a goodbye or a memory video. It's probably also on this channel already. Uh, so I don't have much time to record anymore, so I guess I'm just gonna take... A small mat. Also I found medium mats somewhere. Um, whoop. and let's go. Eh, I knew it. Cradle. Maybe we should, we should use the water one. Okay, bamboozle. Awesome. One hit is great. One hit is all I need. So, keep going. This is also a pretty nice map, by the way. Oh, fuck. Two more? Yikes. Okay, Cradle. Mm, you know what? We're gonna do it different. Since there's nothing else beside that, I'm gonna do a cut here. Till we are at the trainer. Okay, that took a couple seconds. <laughs> that was that was a pretty ineffective cut. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> that just took a couple seconds. Yikes. Oh, man. Okay, Bamboozle is effective. That's pretty good. 
Ah, uh, yeah. Nice. We got it. Come on, next. Sometimes it's a bit too slow. Okay, Gaglo Love Lady. Taste. What does taste do? Uh, a stun, a stun the enemy with a small jolt that always leaves them with paralysis. Like, is it actually stunning them? And it's better than stare, at least. I don't know if it's stunning them, but it leaves them with paralysis. Does paralysis increase my catch rate? I'm not sure. Also, I wonder, um, did any one of you start to play this game yet? Just interesting. Cradle dead. Ready? That's a good amount of XP. Gah! <laughs> so... Oh, what am I doing so close to the edge? It's dangerous and you be careful. Yep. Oh, no. Uh, I want to go there. Okay, first to them. Then repeat that again. Cut till we're there. Please don't do this, Jeram. It's me, Hayato. We used to train together, don't you? <laughs> this doesn't make any sense. Someone please help me. Hello, me helping. Yeah, I will help. <laughs> oh, man. Another corrupt bug. Oh, he has green stuff. Nice. Plant ones, grass ones, super good. Ineffective against me is always something I'm happy about. I zip and dead. Uh, rest of my team gained experience. Perfect. Level 17. So... Batman Guru, noise. Mm -hmm. Rack Lover. What is Rack Lover? It will take a while. Well, we've already seen this one two times this part and I already forgot the name. I guess I'm just too old to learn new names. I guess if you would ask me about my old name right now, like the, the starter name, I, I don't even know that one. Like, I can, I can probably tell you if you describe it to me properly, how it looks. I can tell you what it is. Like, or, like I can, I can imagine it, but I can't tell you the name. Okay, it's evolving. Um, I've sadly already seen what we're gonna evolve into. Because of the mastery screen. The master screen was basically spoiling me. Spoiling me. But yeah, we're gonna become such a flying insect, right? Yep. We look not bad. Terrafly. Nice name. I will forget it. Uh, learn to move double sting. Okay, yeah, let's see if it's good. Sting the target twice consecutively. Possibly inflict infecting poison. Better than stare. Definitely better than stare. Uh, my head is killing me. What happened? Ayato, why are we in here? You remember me? Oh, thank goodness. Of course I remember you. What are you talking about? You were not yourself. It's as if something took over your mind. What? That's nonsense. What are you saying is, isn't even possible. Unfortunately, I believe you may be wrong. Father, you're here. I came as quickly as I could. Is everyone alright? Yes, we are now. Thanks to, uh... What's your name? <laughs> oh, well. Ipoy, thank you for coming to my rescue. I'm very grateful to you. So, Father, how did you find us? One of the monks ran into the town and collapsed right outside of the battle theater. 
I was not invited and I rushed into the side. I asked what had happened and he in, he he recounted that some of the other monks in the pagoda became violent. He watched several of the monks chase you this way. What would have caused them to turn so violent for the father? Uh, I've never seen anything like that. On my way here, I got caught up in a battle with one of our beloved elders who had gone mad. I defeated him and he seemed to come to his senses. He mentioned something crashed into the upper floor of the pagoda. Whatever it is, it must be the source of our problems. Yes, it's coming back to me. The last thing I remember was going upstairs to check on the noises I was hearing. That's all I can remember before waking up here though. The top floor is where Ika Ikazun rests when it wizards. You don't think Ik Ikazun would have anything to do with this, do you? I don't believe so. I do remember reading through some very old texts stored away in the pagoda. Stories about a case very similar to ours very long ago. It might be a good idea for me to idea to f It might be a good idea for me to find those scrolls and prove over them once more to see what I can learn. However, it is unsafe to enter the pagoda until we can first solve the case at la at hand. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. According to some of our monks, there are still several others inside who have turned. I have an idea. Maybe Ipa could help. Thinking about it, Ipa single-handedly fought their way through several of the other affected elders to get there. <coughs> Sorry. Experience against the Stark Force might be just what we need right now. It only took me 24 hours. What do you say, Poi? Will you help us figure out what's causing this mess in the pagoda? Sure. Excellent. I'm glad we can count on you. I will go ahead and make preparations to ensure you can reach the pagoda. Ordinary citizens cannot normally access the pagoda without uh, special permissions, but this certainly warrants an exception. I will have a word with the elders guarding the pass so that they know to light you through. The pagoda is at the top of the hill on Route 5. If you need anything, it will be in Highway Village. Good luck. I'm counting on you. It kind of reminds me, like, I if it, he talks about the pagoda and the people guarding it, I kind of get a feeling like we're battling ho oh soon. Uh, we can't return to the pagoda right now, so I think we will just head home. Thanks again for helping us. Good luck with the monks at the pagoda. Okay, um, what are we gonna do from here? Oh, hi, outer player. Uh, I'm here. Oh, I can see that there is nothing. Cool. Good, then uh, I'm gonna make a cut and we're gonna see us outside. Alright, we are finally out of here. Oof. And beside me, being almost dead, it also took a long time. We had at least 10 encounters. What the hell? I'm really happy I, I told you about the card there. Yikes. Uh, and the problem is, I mean, I don't know where to go right now. Oh, yeah, we can go over the bridge. The problem is, I'm out of here, but now I have to go back. Like, I could also just force heal up myself, but that would be just a waste of money, I guess. Or maybe we can... I mean, we're gonna see. Maybe we maybe we can find something to, to heal up over there. I can't imagine that you still have to go back all the way. That would be really bad. Yikes. I mean, it, it's okay. It's... it's. I'm always saying that from a creative perspective. For my video, it is bad. In general, I wouldn't care. Then I go back, I get more XP. I don't... I don't give a flip. Honestly, um, it's just bad for the video because I have less time. It's it's bad if you have no time. Like if you expect to be able to rush through right now, then bad. But not actually criticizing the game for it being a bit more difficult than the Switch parts because the Switch parts were ridiculous or are ridiculous. <laughs> it's not like it, it changed. Um. Okay, let's just hope that we can get around that. Okay, we can start here. Just checking, please. Uh, okay, I hope we can enter High War Village first. Seems like it, yeah. Seems like we can go there. I just want to enter the Poké Center. The Lumion Healthcare. <laughs> then we can... Um, do... Please... Okay, whew. I thought she was going to stop me. Okay, then we gotta take a great look at this village. A Sorry, I'm super... Okay. We're gonna take a look at this great village. Not a great look at this village. Yikes. We're gonna take a look at this village later, though. Like, a better look. It's just the first look. I just want to heal up, and then we can go back to the others. 
I guess you don't mind if I'm gonna teleport us there. Great. Alright, we're here, and I also noticed my starter is not following me anymore. Or my first member. Stop right there, young traveler. You must be the wrong train, the young trainer, which Akio has permitted permitted to enter the pagoda. If it were up to me, you would not be permitted to enter our sacred grounds. However, we have found ourselves in a desperate situation. Before I allow you to pass, I must warn you of the dangers that lie ahead. Several of our monks are still cont contaminated um, with that darkness. We fear that if it's not handled soon, a lot of irre irreplaceable artifacts may be damaged beyond repair. We also suspect that Ikazune, um, or Ikazun, um, an ancient Lumion, is present. Be careful not to anger it. A young trainer like yourself may not be able to withstand its wrath. Raph? Rave? Um... Raph? <laughs> I'm not sure. With that, go forward and remember that you walk on sacred grounds. Alrighty, I remember that. So, then we're gonna take a look at it, and we might be able to destroy those after it. Who knows? But, nice temple. Let's see how it looks inside. Okay, interesting, um, he's looking there, same as him, he is looking forward and he's looking to the right, so we could eventually skip all of those, I just don't know if it's, okay, we should have been more careful, <laughs> okay, we don't skip, okay, already, uh, you were attacked by the corrupt monk, okay, Kabunga, Kabunga shouldn't be an issue. Nope, it's not. Perfect. Just giving us a lot of XP, hopefully. Yep, 193. Okay, no, we're not gonna switch. Oh, you're the green starter. That's awesome. Probably gonna want it you as well, or at least do a lot of damage. Yeah, it's wanted. Okay. It's already dead. Level 19, nice. Slime. Okay, we already learned something, I guess. Oh no, it was on the other one. Uh, slime. Launch them at the foe, this may poison them. Yeah, better than not. I guess I shouldn't forget all my normal type attacks. But on the other side, they're way better. All things must have order. Uh, press Feven's button after all others oh god press Fevens button after all other pre buttons are pressed oh god I have to make a screenshot of that okay 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 Fevens button is last okay, you're telling me about them okay mm -hmm. ready pray tell uh. okay I might switch we're gonna use the type advantage. Oh, now it uses swipe, of course it does. Okay, spray. Oh, that's a problem, I guess. It is effective, but it's not strong. I guess we would have caused more damage with the starter. Uh, that's that's a problem. You don't you don't get rewarded if you play the game the right way because the thing you're not leveling to the level it is or the other sorry won't do good damage no matter if you use the type adventure or not that's the problem right now like it depends like if you use like hydro pump for example and you're just two levels below then of course but this move is also pretty strong mm. But the problem is when I'm going to level up this one to a level where it matters. Or where it gets good moves. Batman is already way higher. Batman is getting air moves now, I guess. Nice, air blades. Um, okay, let's see. Bamboozle is actually my strongest move. What the hell? Damn. 
Lance critical, uh, critical hits more often. Okay, then we get rid of Dive Bomb. Dive Bomb misses too often. Nice, now we also got a flying hit. Ambit. Uh, Ambit is fine. I guess they use one type. Oh. Um, then we... Wait. We don't rest, we wait. Oh, Jesus, girl! We could have rested! Ah, unlucky. Okay, spray. We can use two sprays. Mm-hmm, okay. That's effective, true. And one more spray. Did we already use two sprays? Um... I mean, we can rest and hope. Or we can... Yeah, we wait. Another growl? I wonder if it would have attacked if I would have rested. I mean, I remember that back then, your, your opponent uh, uses moves depending on what you did. And then they changed that. Ready, another 180 experience. So, what are you telling me? All things must have ordered. Do not press Ambit's button immediately before or after dribbles. Do not press Ambit's button immediately before or after dribbles. Aha. Uh -huh. What is dribble? One of those. Oh, you're the waterman. Lol, I'm so dumb. You can also see which one they are using. It's obvious. God, sometimes I'm as I ask myself why I'm so... Yeah. Let's not talk about it. Let's, let's just not talk about it. Do we have something that can go against it? Maybe Gaklo. It should be effective. It's water. Yeah, it is. This is Dripple. Uh, I guess we're using Taste. Uh, that was not effective. I mean, it was super effective, obviously, but it didn't cause much damage. And we also wasted 35 EC. So we're using Static Shock, I guess? Oh yeah, that's better. Mmm, that's better. Oh, it's Paralyzed. Awesome. I mean, some, some people maybe notice that sometimes if you paralyze someone, it doesn't work. Like, if you use Paralyzed and it works, but AI mostly still hits. <laughs> Only you never hit. So, okay, um, all things must have order. Press Dribbles button just before Favens. Just before Favens. And we could ignore him. Okay, let me, let me see the orders again. So the first one was press Favens button after all others. Uh, press Dribbles button just before Favens. Do not press Ambit's button immediately before after Dribbles. Dribbles? So it's first. Okay, so technically you gotta press this one. Yes. Okay. So Ambit should be first. Then... Uh, press the button after all the others. Then Dripple is the third one. So technically you're the second. 
right? Uh, no, that was wrong. Wait, 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 wait. I, I changed, uh, switched the names. Ah, oh, god damn it, my screenshots! <laughs> Fuck. Um, again. So, press Faven. Who's Faven? After all the others. Okay, can I redo it? Ah, shit. Okay, I did it wrong. Okay, then we're just gonna press it once more. Hmm. Okay, that's wrong. Perfect. Oh! I get an encounter when I do it wrong. Well, uh, that's fair. That's pretty fair. Okay, bamboozle. Okay, it's that. So, again. Okay, um... I, I'm gonna read it again. Press... Press Favin's button after all other buttons are pressed. I guess this is Favin. Yeah, this is Favin. Uh, do not press Ambit's button immediately before or after Dripples. Press Dripples button just before Favin, so Dripple free. So Ambit 1. Then this one second. Then Dripple first. Eh, uh, sorry. First. <laughs> Pepega. And Favon last. Yeah, that worked. Okay. Um, but actually this part is already pretty long in terms of recording. So, I'd say we're gonna call it here. I'm gonna leave it like this. And then, I hope we're gonna see us back at the next part. Thank you really much for watching and hope to see you next time. Bye bye.